Hey what's up guys welcome to Desi Coder. So in this video we are going to learn how to integrate the version control in Android Studio. So let's start a new project. Tap on a new Android project and select any of the template and give it a name. I will give test underscore VCS and then click on finish so it will create a new project it will take some time to process so here you go the project is now created now let's enable the VCS so here you can see at the top VCS and then search for enable version control integration tap on it and then you can see whatever types you want to use like I want to use git here so click on git and click ok so as you can see at the bottom it says created git repository in the folder where I have created the project so let's edit the file and then we will be committing the file in the git so let's say toast message make text and then this and then your text and then the length and then so let's say a test okay so we have now changed or edited the main activity.java so now we are going to commit the changes so at the top go to VCS and then you will see an option called commit also you can see the same option here at the right and the green icon says commit so tap on commit so you will be seeing what are files you want to commit here so select all the files and then just enter whatever a message you want to type here I will say NSL commit and then tap on commit so it will add all the files in your git and the repository will be updated so we just learned how we can create a git repository now we will check how to create a repository in github so the same way tap on VCS and then go to import into version control and then click on share project on github so it will ask for your login credentials I have already provided or I am already logged in so it has not asked me to log in so once you provide the login credentials you will get a screen like this share project on github and then the repository name I, I have given test underscore VCS you can change it whatever you want to do and then you can click on private if it is private and you don't want others to look into it then choose the private and the remote and the description whatever you want to write here and then click on share so as you can see at the bottom it is retrieving my new username and then it is pushing the project on github so the repository is now created on github as you can see the message successfully shared project on github test underscore vcs so likewise you can integrate git and github in android studio so thanks for watching this video guys, please do hit the like button and subscribe to our channel Desi Coder.